show. Yo, what's up guys? Arctic here again, and today we have a yet another Modern Warfare 3 gameplay commentary, and this time I'm playing on Resistance, uh, the map in like Paris, I think, and I'm using the UMP um, with the Autumn. I mean, yeah, I, I think it's Autumn. Uh, with the Autumn camo, and yeah, it's looking quite beastly. I don't really like the gold camo. I do have it unlocked now, but I just don't like the gold. I think the autumn looks way, way beast, uh, way more beastlier. Sorry. So yeah, and this is a demolition, and I think it's the first time ever I'm posting demolition on my channel. Mostly it's been like when I did Modern Warfare 2, it was mostly like team deathmatch. So yeah, it's something new. And before I even kick off this video and get to some topics, I would like, uh, you know, please guys help me out. My Sony Vegas is rendering the huge files. Uh, for example, this commentary is like uh, 11 point something minutes long. And my Sony Vegas would probably render it to like, I don't know, like 5 gigabytes. And after I render my video with Sony Vegas, I would have to compress it with like, to the H.264 uh, format and that takes like one hour and it's it's really taking a lot of time to for me to put out content for you guys so yeah please if anyone knows the solution to this problem or might have a fix please let me know in the comment section below uh, so yeah on to the topic here and this game is really fun I'm playing with uh, Estonians as as you know, some people may know, I'm from Estonia, and on my team there are only Estonians. Uh, I think it's like, it's like four, we, 4 we 4 versus 4, I think. And we're playing against some, what, the French guys, I think. And yeah. So, because my whole team is from the same country as I am, and that kind of allows us to communicate in our own language, you know, and that's kind of easier. And in this game, the teamwork is just... Fantastic! I really love games where you know you see teamwork and, and things like that. And I try to you know do my best uh, in this game. And I think it turns out quite well. The final score is like what uh, 36 to 9 maybe. And when you think about it, that's not such a beastly score. But this is demolition. And as you can see in this video, I really did try to do objectives as much as possible. And I did get many points for that. So, yeah. And in my previous video, I said that I would never prestige. Um, yeah, I kind of broke that promise. <laughs> right now, I'm fourth prestige, level 80. And I am not prestiging more. And seriously, guys, this wasn't a level hack. I, I just play a lot. Uh, seriously, this wasn't a level hack. I'm just super active in the game. Uh, so yeah, I, I really like the game and Also, I want to talk about the problems Modern Warfare 3 has in this commentary But first I'm gonna start off with good news um, Well, it's not really news, but good. Let's say opinions from me of Modern Warfare 3 the game is you know, I have I have played it. Sorry for like uh, the barracks in game uh, shows me that I have played it for like two days now, like 50 hours, and yeah, I prestige quite a lot. And my opinions of the game are quite good. It's it's a big big step from Modern Warfare 2. I mean, you know, we we still got some uh, free space space to clear, but you know, it's a big gap. And you know, the balancing usually is great, except Akimbo machine pistols. This just akimbo machine pistols. They just they just make me a rage quit, and I'm sure I'm not the only one. Many many people right now are talking about this. Um, the akimbo machine pistols, uh, the FMG9 and the Scorpion, uh, you know, both uh, machine pistols. When you put akimbo on them, and you know, akimbo for secondaries unlocks at what like level five, you know, weapon le level five. And you know you can get like weapon level five in two games, maybe even one game if you play only with your secondary. So yeah, it's kind of overpowered. And you know, for example, if you face a juggernaut, 
and you're with a sniper, Barrett 50 cal, you would have to put 10 headshots, 10 headshots into the juggernaut to kill him. And by the way, nice shot there. Um, okay. <laughs> and as I was saying, you have to put 10 headshots uh, in a row into a juggernaut in order for him to die. But, you know, why waste your time and bullets? You could just, you know, wipe out your secondaries, the FMG9 Akimbos, and, you know, you usually put like half of your magazine into the juggernaut and boom, they're dead. And also, those things have, have the range of a submachine gun, I would say. Because it's, you know, the most, most times I get killed, it's by Akimbo machine pistols, let's face it. Um, I do, you know, I do consider myself a good player. I, you know, I don't mean like uh, C Nanners Pro or Hutch Pro, but tri triple there. <laughs> this game is awesome. <laughs> Anyways, I don't consider myself to be like MLG Pro, but I just think I'm good. Um, pretty much always get positive scores in my games, so I think I'm quite good. And yeah, but most I get I get a lot of deaths from machine pistol guys, especially those with akimbo, and I will admit it, I have many, many times uh, rage quit a game because of machine pistol guys, and as some, of you, as some of you guys may know, when you quit a game before it actually ends, it counts as a loss on your, what is it, like, uh, win streak or something, like, in the barracks game menu, main menu, you can actually see how many games you have played, how many games you have won, how many games you have lost in it. And let's face it, I have like 400 losses and like 350 wins. And you know, like at least 200 losses are from rage quitting. Seriously, I just. There have been times when a, enemy, a guy in the enemy team has a Kimbo FMG9s and the whole team looks at it and wow that gun is effective and puts it on to you know try to play against a team with a Kimbo FMG9s it's just it's just unfair I, I really hope it gets patched by Infinite War because they promised they would actually listen to the community more this time than they did with Modern Warfare 2 and I really hope that they do for God's sake, I hope, because you know I'm not sure if I can handle more Warfare for three for you know, one year before I can play uh, Black Ops Two or whatever it's called. And my screen went black here, so sorry guys, I can't see what's going on. My Sony Vegas is messing up again. The preview screen is black, and I can only see how much time I have left till this commentary ends. Right now, it's what like four minutes. So yeah, okay. Uh, so yeah, sorry guys, can't really commentate about the game here. But yeah, in this game I pick up a couple of enemy sniper rifles and it turns out to be quite effective and back to the problems again. I actually don't think that they will patch the Akimbos because in Modern Warfare 2 the noob tubes, uh, the noob tube, sorry, was a big, big, big issue and they always, you know, gave us promises that we're gonna fix it, we're gonna fix it. You know, one month, one month later, nothing, and you know, it just, it just makes me sad. But I, I hope, I sincerely, I hope that they will patch it this time. I think that they should have learned a lot from now. I mean, you get what I mean. My tongue is messed up right now. <clears throat> so yeah, and this commentary is kind of made in a hurry because. My basketball training actually starts in five minutes and my coach is gonna kick my ass and I really should go but I'm gonna fi finish this commentary for you guys okay and also please please remember to like and comment on this video it really helps a lot it you know keeps me motivated to bring out co more content for you guys and you know my last one of the three commentary was like a week ago I've been posting uh, some fails, you know, a Predator Missile Quad fail and a Care Package fail. Those are just things that, you know, are easy to render and easy to upload. It doesn't take much time, but, um, you know, when I would get more feedback on my videos, like currently I have, like, what, 700 subscribers? And I average, like, what, um, 200 views a video? 
you know, that's fine to me, but I do get a decent amount of likes in my opinion too, like 10 to 20 likes. Oh, my screen came back, yay! And I averaged like 10 to 20 likes a video, but I usually get like one, two comments. You know, comments really are the thing that really means to me the most. I mean, you know, likes are good, but you know, comments, I just think comments are more important than likes, you know. Uh, depending on what's inside the comments, of course. So yeah, and this commentary is soon coming to an end. This is a flawless game. Well, not really flawless, but we won like two to nothing. So yeah, it's quite good. I actually laughed quite a quite a lot after this game. <clears throat> and yeah, I'm gonna be trying to bring you guys more collateral there. More uh, Modern Warfare 3 content. I'm gonna try and put the video up every like three days, maybe even more often. Depends on what content I get. If I get a good fail, I will definitely post it just so you can you guys can watch it. And you know, I'm gonna try and make a commentary soon, but you know, it depends on what feedback I get on this video. So yeah, this game is ended. So yeah guys, as I said before, please, please remember to like and favorite this video, it helps a lot, and comment of course, and my title, I mean my emblem looks epic. So yeah guys, I'm Arctic, my YouTube channel is Purify Games, please, please like and comment, peace.